In our previous videos, we have seen how to see all the parameters of an element and also their storage type and how to get any parameter as output. All of these videos are available on our channel. You can also find this using i button. In this video, we will see how to change value of any parameter using Dynamo. For this, we will need one node. You will get the node from here. Go to Revit, Elements, here again Element, and here set parameter by name. See, this node takes three input. One is element, another is parameter name. This is uh, that is basically a string, and last one is value. And we will get an output from here. So disconnect this and connect this to this. We will see the output from here. First input is element. So just connect from here to element. Next one is parameter name, which is string. Suppose I will work with now comment parameter. Comment is also a parameter in Revit. So I will add anything in comment. So let's see. I will simply copy the screen. And for copying there is a shortcut. Just click the string. Keep on pressing mouse button and hold control key on keyboard. And drag. See, our string is copied. But we have to change this to comment. Actually this is comments, you can verify from here. Here, this is comments and these all are case sensitive so, so you have to write this C as capital and now connect this to parameter name. And here this value is variable you can provide anything here any string or any integer suppose I am providing another string here same I'm just copying it and suppose for example I am writing here my element let's see it's work or not just connect to this value and run it okay so we are getting the duct as element output you see here is also duct but I have to see the comment there is two way you can see the comment assigned to this duct one is go to the Revit and another is from Dynamo first one just go to Revit here click on this duct and scroll down to comment C there is my element next we will see that is you Dynamo for this we will need one node that is get parameter value by name just click there and you will see here this will take element as input so just connect the element here to here and parameter name that is uh, comment you can connect from here to parameter name and simply copy that watch node same process click control drag and connect this to this now just run it see comment of that element is my element that's it so if this video is helpful to you please like this video share this video and subscribe to our channel thank you